Hello. Today we're going to talk about model melodies in Byzantine music. Have you ever been in church and you heard a hymn that sounded familiar to you, but the words were ones you hadn't heard before? I'm going to explain to you one reason why that might happen. Byzantine music has many model melodies on which other hymns are based. We have an example of this coming up this Sunday during liturgy. This Sunday, we'll celebrate St. Paisios, a relatively new saint in the Orthodox Church. Here's his Apolitikion. Once the fire of love for the Lord was lit in you, through ascetical rigor you gave yourself to God. O oh God bearing Saint Paisios, for many you became. Consolation giving counsel with God inspired words, and by your prayers working wonders. And now, devout one, you intercede for the whole world unceasingly. Does that sound familiar to you? Well, it's modeled after one of our eight resurrectional apolitikia. This is a hymn that we'll hear during the liturgy about every eight weeks. Here's how it starts in Greek. Here's how it starts in English. Let us worship the Word who is unoriginate. Now here's the beginning of St. Baisios' hymn again. Once the fire of love for the Lord was lit in you. So what's going on? This happens very often in Byzantine music. The model hymn, Don Sinanarchon Logon, is called an aftomolon. The plural of that word is aftomola. A hymn that is written to a model melody is called a prosomion, and the plural is prosomia. The name of an aftomolon is just its first line, so in a service book, a chanter might see the text of a hymn that he doesn't know how to sing, but at the top, it'll have the first line of the aftomolon. For example, this hymn of St. Paisios in English would say at the top, let us worship the word, and the chanter would know what melody to sing it to. Now here's a big challenge that Byzantine music has faced in English. A hymn that is written in Greek and sung to a particular melody needs to be translated into English in a way that it can be sung to the same melody. This is no easy task. The translated words have different numbers of syllables with stress in different places and it's just not the same. If we take a hymn text and just translate it without thinking about that, it's almost never going to fit. If we try to sing it to the same melody anyway, it's probably not going to sound good. For a long time, some people thought it just couldn't be done. But over the last few decades, some very talented people have applied themselves to this work with great results, allowing us to have Orthodox Church music in English that fits the melodies and still has that Byzantine music sound. It's not only possible, but it's being done. So we had Byzantine chant vocabulary this week, a model melody is an aftomolon. The plural is aftomola. A hymn written to a model melody is a prosomion. The plural is prosomia. And now you've learned about one of the building blocks of Byzantine music. If you'd like to learn more, subscribe to this YouTube channel and send your questions. See you next week.